Hey guys, Ress and Rambles 89 back with another reaction video today. This time I'll be reacting to Stone Cold, talking about why Gold Dust got his push ended in the Attitude Era. Now Gold Dust started off as a lot more controversial, a lot more edgy, and then it suddenly went away with a lot more goofiness and yeah, Gold Dust is still out of a hell of a career, don't get me wrong, but let's hear because I'm curious why exactly that happened. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. Hey, let's talk a little bit about some of uh, the, the, the characters or the Attitude Era. Was Goldust already around when you came on board? Goldust was just yeah, starting when so. I came on board, but at the very beginning, I started writing all his verbiage. I mean, I, I, I started that literally from, from day one. And, I mean, I think it kind of went in a direction that Vince hadn't – particularly planned on it just kind of went that way and then obviously i mean i think he was getting a lot of pushback sponsors and usa so we really had to pull in the reins well but whose idea was gold dust was, was that dustin's idea or was it vince's it, it was it was one of the two i wasn't involved right. in the birth of it i i came aboard once it was already developed but it man, I tell Vince. you what, that was a time when I was riding with Dustin. We were traveling partners, and I was working, you know, in the first half of the card, maybe anywhere between second, third, fourth match, uh, intermission. And then, you know, Dustin was working, Goldust was working in the main event with Shawn Michaels. You know, business was okay, and they were having hellacious matches because, you know, Shawn Michaels is one of the greatest workers of all time. Yeah. Uh, and over, and then Dustin just had a ton of heat, and he was so good at being Goldust. And, Dustin could always work his ass off. He's one of my favorite guys to work with. Nice. And they were just killing it every night. And I, I saw the heat, and it was real heat, and I loved it. But then they just chopped his legs out from under him, mm. and I just felt so bad for Dustin because he was so hot, so high, and then just boom, down to the ground. What in the flying hell happened? Well, that's it, Steve. You know, that that's the thing. It's like I wrote all the verbiage, so I would make sure – it was all innuendo. It, it was 100%, 100% yeah. innuendo. He was messing with the mind. Yeah. But what happened was, I think especially like through Kevin Dunn and television, you know, they st the letters started to come in and this group and that group and the advertisers. And Damn. next thing I know, you know, Vince is calling me in the office and pulling back the reins. And I'm like, Vince, Listen to what he's saying. It's innuendo. That's all it is. And, bro, I felt the same exact way you felt. I was like, how can you do this to this guy? I mean, it's, it's, it's money. It's, you know, it's the best thing he's ever done. Yeah. yeah. I guess, you know, just business just pulled it way back. But, you know, but, you know to, to pull that back there and to, to move forward with some of the other things that we were doing. So it's like you, you, you stop one thing, but then you push the envelope in a different direction. Well, I, I think, though, Steve, it, when the letters start coming yeah. in, groups, yeah. I think that's when you start, okay, we got to. Right. Yeah. So ha have you watched the WWE product lately? Yeah, I've been watching it lately, yeah. Okay, so now you know. Now he, he's back on television. Obviously, it's a toned down no, so deal. I'm, I'm at least glad to see him in, in, within oh, the current uh, yeah. roster because, again, he's always one of my, been one of my favorite guys, and I hated to see what happened to his run back in the day. Okay, so sorry, guys. First of all, I didn't realize Russo was involved, so I know some people don't like him, but he can still be interesting from time to time. And sorry, too, I didn't realize it was an old clip. But it was still interesting anyway. Austin has always been a big fan of Dustin. He always loved working with him. I was aware of that already. I already think and know that Gold Dust was a great character. Dustin Rhodes always puts on good matches. He's still far better than he has any right to be in AEW. And yeah, I was curious why. And I guess it's just a shame as always the censors and those so-called pressure groups or parent groups or whatever writing and complaining have ruined so many great things it's a damn shame and i'm a little surprised vince gave up if that's the right word but yeah it's just a shame for dustin it's a shame for the fans because the gold dust character was pretty damn entertaining but credit to dustin rhodes he made that gimmick work and he certainly made it good again in the future even after a bit of a rough patch after that so yeah, I just thought this would be interesting for you guys. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. I upload new videos every single day. This is Wrestling Rebels 89 signing off.